inspired, I will ask like quirky questions so that it really feels, you know, as if, um, you know, it's like, you know, when people watching a video, they're saying, oh, stop the sales talk. And I might, I might just have a, suddenly I'll have like a spur of a moment in, you know, um, spontaneous. This is just going to be a two-way exchange though, Yeah, right? yeah, okay. yeah, yeah. So I'm going to count down. Okay. Four, three, two, one. Hi, everybody. This is Angelique Tsang from Let Love Come To You. And I have an amazing guest from the USA, Jonathan Asley, from the website understandmannow.com. And Jonathan is the male spy into the guy's mind as a dating and relationship coach specifically for women. And I can tell you that I had a really good uh, one hour interview with him about the topic the relationships men commit to and why. And it's based on an e course that Jonathan has designed. Jonathan, what can people or women and men look forward to when they're going to listen to this interview? <laughs> oh my gosh, they're gonna, they're, I think they're gonna learn a lot. I think we had a fantastic time, and as I said before, thank you so much for having me on the summit. It's truly an honor to be part of your group with this fantastic lineup of uh, <sighs> coaches and experts you put together. I'm yes. just grateful to be a part of it. So thank, thank you so you. much for that. Yeah. And I, I think they're going to learn a lot in the interview. They're going to learn about understanding men in relationships. They're going to understand, they're going to learn about the different types of relationships men commit to and so much why they commit to those relationships. I think we've kind of outlined a couple different types of guys so women can be on the lookout <laughs> for different types of guys. And we went into a real, I thought our discussion was fantastic. We went into the progression of the different men in different stages of their life and their age brackets and whatnot. So I, I had a blast. Um, so yeah. And, I and hope you did too. <laughs> I mean, I, when you listen to the interview, you can hear me almost like giggle or laugh uncontrollably. And it, it, it wasn't always because it was so much, because sometimes the things that you were saying like rang so true to me and yeah so that's why i started laughing sometimes uncontrollably um and jonathan is also a poet because he we talked about for instance why men pull back and what women then start doing and he he said that some women go into a emotional grand canyon and i was just started laughing like crazy and also um he said something around the limiting beliefs that women walk around with and the lim one of the limiting beliefs that, you know, that I hear all the time, of course, um, yeah. and that I probably invest a lot of time in as well is like, you know, there are no good men out there, you know, uh, or men just don't want to commit. And one of yes. the things that you, you talked about is, is actually what you teach is there are a, a lot of amazing men out there looking for you yeah. and that want to commit. It's just that we need to be more aware of the stages of men that we are attracted to and yeah. the types of men that we are attracted to and to be to be maybe I think what you're what you've taught us uh, Jonathan is that um, there's a true difference between falling in love and all the brain chemicals and yes. true love so that was also a discussion that we went into yes. and that you know sometimes there's a huge confusion around that and that the detox period of this, 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 this infatuation, <laughs> infatuation with the wrong person in the wrong, in the wrong life stage, whatever, can really yeah. wreak havoc. And and you've told, um, you've also made it clear that um, for you, it is your passion and purpose to actually help women be more clear about what they're doing. And I really yes. want to thank you for that, Jonathan. Yeah, I, I really enjoyed the interview. Um, um, so in terms of men, if, if oh, you... Oh, by the way, I, I had so much fun, so thank you. It was my <laughs> pleasure. Yeah, so, so, and I think, you know, Jonathan, what, so this is like a controversial question. What can men learn when they listen to this interview? Because I think men can learn a lot from this interview mm. as well, because they might be able to see how they can progress. Sure. Uh, it's, I think for men, what they're going to gain from this, uh, and, and certainly the women are going to absolutely, I think it's just a sense of awareness. I think the more we are aware to the little nuances and differences between men and women, and really, we all want the same thing. We want love. We do. We want love. We want to feel part of something. Yeah, okay? Yeah. I think we're disconnected, especially here in the United States. It's such a, we're, we're taught, it's drilled in our heads to, you know, truthfully, 
I think all of us, to some, we, we want to feel loved. We do. Yeah. But we have struggles and challenges because we lack awareness. And my hope is that for the men, for those men that are going to listen to this, that you go, hmm, you know what? Jonathan gave me an aha moment. Maybe I need to seek therapy. Maybe I need to seek personal growth work. Maybe I need to understand that this is what women go through. Like, <laughs> oh, God, you know, I, don't, I don't want a woman to go through this pain and heartache. I want, I'm a good guy. I want to understand. So my hope is that the, the men listening will gain a sense of awareness and maybe an aha moment for themselves. Yeah. And I can tell people, you know, um, I've been making, I, I read the book, I, I so I actually have done the e-course of Jonathan, but still I was making notes. I mean, because it's just, you know, because you read things differently and it's almost like the teacher was standing in front of the class, so I, I felt I felt compelled to make notes again. So Well, and, when I first yeah. wrote this, I wrote it just strictly as a PD, you know, as a book, and I thought, you know what, let me add the audio to this to really understand the progression yeah. throughout each section of the book. So understanding how men fall in love, uh, understanding men and children, why men need space, all of these little nuances of understanding men. Just little, and it's so, you said you did a speed read course. You literally, it's such an easy, the PDF is such an easy read, you can do it in a short period of time. Yeah, and it will actually really open up your eyes, and you can always look back. When you when you confuse yourself again, you can actually go back again. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> no, I really enjoyed it, and I and I will continue to, to, to read your newsletters, because I really uh. like your newsletter. Thank you so much, Jonathan, for this, uh, this very insightful interview. Yes. Uh, well, again, thank you for allowing me to be in the summit. I'm so looking forward to listening to the other uh, experts as well. So, and, yes. and listening. And you're a fantastic host, so thank you. Oh, wow. I'm, I'm floating now. <laughs> thank you. Thank okay. you. We'll talk later. Bye-bye. Okay, take care. Bye-bye.